Hello everyone, welcome to the Down to Earth Trimming Tool Tutorial. You've just received your kit, how very exciting! You'll notice that you have three tools that are color coordinated, so blue for small, yellow for medium, and red for large. Let's see how you should hold your tools. You'll notice that I'm holding it almost like a pencil, and the important thing to remember is that you need to keep as many fingers as possible on your tool, depending on the size that you're using. Here I am trimming a vase. I'll be using the large tool, so the one with the red handle, to come trim both the curve and eventually the base. More on that later. As you can see, I'm using my right hand to hold the tool and my left hand to stabilize, while also having my right elbow firmly pressed against my leg in order to stabilize the entire trimming experience. We wouldn't want to have a notch appear in our piece because we weren't stable enough. It's important also to try and keep as many fingers on your tool as possible. Once we're done with curves, we can move on to the base. As with the vase, since this is a large piece, I'm using the red-handled large tool. I'll use the same side to finish the curve of this piece and then switch things around and use the corner piece of the tool to shape my foot. As you can see, both my elbows are firmly pressed against my legs and as many fingers as possible are on the tool. Each potter is different, but my feet are usually about one centimeter wide and I'll remove the clay from the center of the base by trimming starting in the center and moving towards the exterior edge. This tool is ideal for large pieces such as dinner plates or platters since it removes a lot of clay at each pass. Since your hands are on the tool, you can modify the angle at which it's resting against the clay, controlling the amount of clay you are trimming away at each pass. I find it's much more intuitive than a traditional trimming tool that has a handle, since my hands are closer to the clay. Another advantage of this tool is that the thickness of the blade is much more durable than most commercial tools that have thinner blades, and they can wear down after a few months of constant use. I've had my set of trimming tools for at least 10 years, and it's served me very well. When trimming smaller pieces, reach for your blue or yellow tools in order to trim your piece easily and with pleasure. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Feel free to comment below if you have any questions or any feedback for us, and a link to our Etsy shop is in the description.